Hi, this is Christina from office to docom In this lesson, I'm going to show you how to edit the text in your Excel workbook. Excel offers you various tools for text editing, enabling you to make the tables more illustrative and effective. The tools are located in Home tab under Font and Alignment. The first one enables you to change the text itself, the other one the placement of the text. In Excel, the text can be edited in two ways, cell-wide or inside the cell. Cell-wide change is rather easy. Either you choose one cell or multiple by either clicking and dragging or selecting whilst holding down control on your keyboard. The last one is useful in case the cells you wish to edit are not connected. Now that we have the cells selected, simply apply the effects. Changing the text inside the cell is a bit more complicated, but rather straightforward nevertheless. You can either double-click on the cell with your left mouse button and select the words you wish to edit, or click on the cell and then on the formula bar just top of the spreadsheet. On this field you can also select the words and apply the new style. Now let's move on to the tools themselves. Remember, most of them have a live preview, so simply hover over to choose the one suitable for you. Under Font, the first thing you can do is change the font for the text selected. Another useful option is changing the size of the text. To emphasize some parts of text or show its special characteristics, you have the tools called Bold, Italic and Underline. They make the text looking bold, a bit out of the vertical or having a line under accordingly. The line in fact can also be changed by clicking on the small down facing arrow next to the underline button. And of course you can change the color of the entire cell background or the text inside the cell or both. Remember to use standard colors in case you are going to share this document with someone having an older version of Office Excel. Under alignment you can change the way text is presented in selected cells, both horizontally and vertically. You can place the text either on top, on bottom, middle, left and right. You can also change the place the text starts in the cell by clicking on buttons Decrease Indent or Increase Indent. And this is it for now on editing the text in Excel. Thank you for listening and tune in for more guidance on Excel on office Bye!